The pictures say it all. It's just unbelievable how fast it happened, you know. Probably five minutes and all this was done. A town hit by an EF3 tornado leaving the town in pieces. Pieces Reading residents are now trying to put back together. I think each uh, each one of these tornadoes brings uh, a tremendous amount of devastation and if you're one of the affected individuals they're all the same. It really doesn't matter um, what size the tornado is. The tornado struck the town of about 250 Saturday night at 930. Matt Rilsback was visiting his girlfriend. We went down into the storm cellar. I closed the door and then a cabinet fell on top of us on top of the door so we were trapped down in there and I got service somehow down there and he called the sheriff's department for us and they came and got us out. Meanwhile Ivy Woods and her family were trying to escape the three block wide tornado. The lightning struck and it was on the ground. She and her family hopped in their truck and tried to drive away when she was sideswiped. Somebody's truck flying through the air, I guess. They managed to escape the storm with only stitches, but there was one fatality. 55-year-old Don Chessmore died in the tornado after his mobile home flipped over. Officials don't know how much all the damage will cost. The economic impact is going to be huge. We had a few small businesses in town, and, and, and every one of them has been damaged, uh, some of them completely destroyed. And while it will take a long time to rebuild, residents say they will stick together. In Reading, Lindsay Elliott, KTKA 49, ABC News.